Brown seems especially excited about this. Maybe he's happy that the music stopped. Me too, Brown. That's how we celebrate around here. First, I'm going to collect more shiny stuff. Lollipop? Aha! You know, this game is probably generous enough with health items that it's probably not going to be that big of an issue. So as long as I keep doing decent, we should be okay. Hey, even something for you too, Brown. The arrival station of the mischievous prince's train did not have the girl's name on it. Left behind, she was all alone. What an unfortunate girl. What? Is there anything we do about that? Or do we just say, hey, this kid's probably crazy, and go about our day? I vote for the latter. It's not even a sh- oh, okay, it is a shiny thing. Jennifer picked up the crumpled piece of paper that was thrown at her. It reads, Jennifer the Thief. I didn't even steal it. Punk ass kids. Probably don't need a pledge. Stash this away for now. Add another drumstick to the rubbish bin. But yeah, we have three minced pies now, three shortbreads, and two lollipops, so that's pretty okay. No, no, the music's back. I'm here to help, kids. The two princesses didn't let the unlucky girl join their conversation. Wherever she went, she was all alone. What a lonely, unlucky girl. I want to find the options menu and turn the music... I want to turn the music off. It's getting on my nerves. Where are these trick shots coming from? There's nothing even over here. Someone ricocheted that shit down the hall and hit me. Jennifer picked up a crumpled piece of paper that was thrown at her. It reads, Beggar plus thief equals terrible Jennifer. If you say so. I don't know if your math checks out. small-hearted princess concentrating on her chores seemed forced and unnatural. The unlucky girl became sad, and then she was alone again. What a hapless, unlucky girl. Yes, I'm quite unlucky. Dinner for blah blah blah, it reads, you get what you deserve. How many more kids must I find? I've been to the library now. Oh, 
We found the ringleader. Can we just do battle and settle this? I'm bigger and stronger than you are. No matter what the unlucky girl said to her, the strong-willed princess would only gaze lethargically. Asleep or awake, the girl was alone. Unlucky. <laughs> it reads, Apologize by dying. Wow. That's messed up. This music makes me want to dive off this balcony. The cold princess simply stared up into the sky. Unlucky girl. No paper being thrown at me this time? I may have an idea of where this story is going. Possibly. Oh, there it is. Come to the hall. Well, where the hell's the hall? I don't know my way around here, and the map doesn't help. That's violent. We just taking that like a champ? <laughs> Alright, well that happened. Moving on. <laughs> Let me out. This place is a hellacious nightmare. There are doodles all over the portrait. And a shiny thing. Is that a lollipop? Yes, it is. Awesome. I'm ready for a boss fight. Is this making the music shut up? A diary is left open on the desk. The children are spreading rumors about a killer named Stray Dog. They say he comes at dusk under the cover of darkness and devours the children he kidnaps. Disturbingly, the rumors seem to be motivated by the recent disappearances that have the public in a panic. However, I found that the rumors I used to get the children to do their cleaning are working splendidly. The orphanage is spotless. I'm such a clever teacher. Useless information? Where am I going? I'm trapped in this horrible orphanage for this horrible music. Lumberjack axe. Might have to say goodbye to the shovel. It's a little rusty. But an axe is an axe. <laughs> That's accurate. Let's check the range. Perhaps a little shorter than the shovel. And a bit shorter than the pipe, I would say. But an axe is an axe. Brown would prefer some drumsticks and such. A well balanced meal for any dog. Well, Brown, that should make you happy. Boys and girls, cleaning time is over. Waste paper 
Time to bed, Diana, Elena, Xavier, Meg, Susan, Nicola, Thomas, Clara, Olivia. Be thankful for this wonderful day, and let us pray for an even better day tomorrow. Get ready for bed, and may you have a good night's rest. We've been standing here for hours? <laughs> this month's gift is Filthy Jennifer. Well, that's not good. You want to save yourself from this horrible music. Yes. Well, we found more food and an axe, so that's cool. But, ugh, that music. Never again, please. Are we still in the funeral? I want to move on now. Even though there was no funeral to be had there. Are you sure you guys want to do this? I have a shiny new axe, you know. And I'm off! This way. No idea where I'm going. Headmaster. Oh, of course you would lock yourself in there, you jerk. Let's go this way, Brown. This way seems less dangerous. Everyone's trying to kill me. I'm not the gift of the month. The rat stands in your way. The pig stands in your way. The goat stands in your way. Oh, Wendy. Wendy, help me. No, this is no time to wave. I need help. He's got a stool, and, but there's a shiny thing. I kind of want the shiny thing. Ah, fish? There's fish here too? I'm, I'm getting the... Asshole. It was worth a minced pie though, I would say. Oh, another one? Back off, fish. I will knock you over. Anymore? Aha! Shortbread? Okay, I would say this room was pretty well worth it. Now to make a daring escape. There you go, Brown. So... I assume we have to fight a rat, a goat, and a pig in order to escape outside. Though I have no idea where those fights will take place. How about this room? The play area. Everyone fights in the play area. Is it? It's one on one? You messed up. You don't know about my axe, do you? I just, I just wanted to play with the trains. <laughs> 